the other thing that I hear, Chris, and I don't know if you do, is the idea that an owner or a CEO or a leader in an organization says, you know, I want AI to help me eliminate a headcount for the staff I have on hand. I'm going to be honest. I have heard leaders bluntly say, I want the magic button to help me replace my recruiting team. I want to cut down my headcount to save money. But if one button is going to replace your recruiters, what kind of recruiters are you hiring? And more importantly, what expectation are you holding them to? There's a bigger problem at hand here, if that's what you're thinking. Now, what I do want you to be thinking is, how can it help my teams be quicker, more efficient in their approaches on what they're working on daily? How can my teams use the tools that we have in place today or in conjunction with the tools that we have today to make their jobs easier? Um, and last but not least, do I have the processes laid out clearly for my teams to execute? So that means two parts. It means new teams, so new people coming into your organization, as well as existing teams can ramp up quickly to do the task at hand. Do they really know what's going on in the background whenever you have AI in the mix, or is it just a Band-Aid? And you as a leader have to communicate this.